What's up everyone, my name is Alex from Tech Media Guys and in today's video I'm going to be talking about the Nintendo Switch controllers on the PC. So if you'd seen the news over the last week, we can see that the Pro Controller and also the Joy-Con controllers and I imagine other controllers as well if in the future, um, they're currently working on PC, they're just a standard Bluetooth device, sync them up with your PC or even mobile phone, tablet, things like that and they will work as a standard game controller. So. Um, just want to talk a bit about how this can, uh, how this will uh, help the emulation side, because um, you know once we do start to see the emulators coming out for the Nintendo Switch, um, hopefully the, the guys who are making Simu for the Wii U and uh, Dolphin for GameCube and Wii, maybe they, they will change development over to the, to the Switch to, um, you know, uh, help on that. Um, I have got a video talking about the uh, uh, Nintendo Switch emulation. Um, you probably see it on my channel. You might see it in the recommended videos if you want to click on that. That's fine. Um, but yeah, that's what I'm going to be talking about today. I also do want to apologise for the Titanfall footage. Um, obviously, it's not Nintendo footage when we're talking about the Nintendo situation. Um, that's purely because you, you, Nintendo won't allow me to monetize the video and uh, allow the ad revenue. You know, it pays the bills. So <laughs> even though it's not that much, but uh, that's basically it. So putting some Titanfall in the background. And so yeah, that's the gist of the video. So the Pro Controller and the Joy-Con on the PC. So at the moment you can hook up a single controller at once. So you can hook up the Pro Controller, uh, you can hook up a Joy-Con but only a singular Joy-Con so you can't hook them up both up at the same time to work uh, at the same time, you know like uh, how they would on the Switch but that can be fixed and more than likely will be fixed um, via custom drivers I would imagine unless Nintendo released them themselves because you know Sony did um, but you know, um, Nintendo seem to be a bit backwards in this uh, modern day, so whether they will re release official support is unknown at the moment. So yeah, so the Pro Controller works, and a lot of people are saying that it's working quite nice, you know, they, they prefer the Pro Controller to say a PlayStation or an Xbox controller, and um, I'll leave some links down below to the videos of people using them. Um, but yeah, it's still using it on the PC. So when the emulators do start to come out, we'll be able to actually use the official Nintendo con controllers quite easily. More than likely the Pro Controller, you're gonna get one of them, sync it up to your computer via Bluetooth, or if you don't have Bluetooth on, get a Bluetooth dongle, sync it up, and you'll be able to play your, your games quite nice. Um, and honestly, when the emulators do come out, I'm gonna do some more videos on that. So if you wanna click the subscribe button to um, be notified in the future when the update videos start coming out. Um, yeah, as for the Joy-Con as well, the Joy-Con will be quite different because um, they have got motion sensors in, so they wouldn't, I imagine they would need some drivers for that as well. Um, but they aren't like the Wii's one, but they've got like an infrared sensor on, so they are all contained and sent the, and they send the information via the Bluetooth, I imagine. Um, so yeah, that's quite nice to see. And um, So yeah, as I said, we're looking forward to the Nintendo Switch emulators coming in the future. Hopefully, I can get a Switch sometime soon. I don't want to get one anytime soon to be honest. I do want to get one eventually, maybe in a year's time. I'm just waiting for these games to come out because you know the game's lineup is um, quite shallow at the moment um, and I don't mind playing, I would like to play Zelda but at this moment it's not a priority for me so um, yeah also uh, in the future in the next month or so I'm going to be building a new PC so if you like PC stuff stay, stay subscribed for that going to be getting a GTX 1080 Ti more than likely or just a GTX 1080 unsure at the moment still um, debating that but yeah also getting a Ryzen CPU as well so if you're if you're interested in that uh, subscribe for that um, but yeah my name's been Alex from Tech Media Guys and um, as I said look forward to my uh, new content coming in the future and uh, leave a comment down below leave a like on the video and I'll see you guys in the next one